Yo, what is up everybody? Welcome back to another video. We are here in Colorado to play the Buffaloes. Um, so yeah, I'm not, I'm not including any uh, Sims footage in this one because we are playing two games here and I just want to get these two out of the way so we can do our season finale. But then they go play action. They're going to go deep and Daniels is going to get beat for the huge touchdown and he's going to score a touch. No, no. Daniels is going to take him down. But it's going to be a 76 yard bomb out the gate. Nick Daniels caught slipping already. That is not a good start. <laughs> that is not a good start even though we are up 7 0. That was a good hustle play. Second goal. They're going to run it into the end zone for a touchdown. Alex Fontenot with the score there. Let's jump ahead a little bit. 24 to 17 here. Oregon State with the lead. So this is a little bit competitive. They're gonna throw it short. And it's gonna be fumbled out and Oregon State is gonna recover. Oh goodness. That was huge, but Oregon State would not capitalize. Colorado ball here. They're gonna look to throw it. Throwing it deep and he's got his man. Inside the 10, 30 yards, Maurice Bell. First and goal. Sending a guy in motion here, they're gonna look. Daniel's gonna come up here and make the tackle. Make that second and goal. Here we go, they're looking, they're gonna run it. Daniel's coming up here and he's gonna get the sack. Negative three yards on the play. That is a beautiful sack. I was like right there for it, boom. And Mr. Stevenson goes down for the sack. Five minutes to go here in the third. I mean the second rather. 24-20 as Colorado would end up scoring some points there. They're going to look to throw it. Deep. Oh my god. It's picked off. And I meant short. But it's picked off nonetheless. And Oregon State would put up some points. 31-20. They're going to be looking. Looking. Throwing it. Deep. And Daniels is going to pick that one off. That is mine, baby. That one is mine. Unbelievable. All right. 41 20 now. Fourth quarter, third and seven. They're going to throw it deep, and I knew I would mess up right then and there. I tried to guess, and uh, he saw what I was doing, and he thought it was a bomb. 75 yards touchdown. That's going to make it 27 48. Four minutes to go here. Fourth and six. This is pretty much the game right here. They're going to look to throw it. Daniels knocks that one down. And that's a turnover on downs. And that, my friends, is going to be the end of this one as Oregon State gets a big win here on the road. Um, good performance overall. I gave up some plays though. I gave up two long plays that ended up being touchdowns. One, one we stopped them short and the Indians scored like next play, but play of the game is Jamari Jefferson with four total touchdowns on the day. Oregon State gets a, gets a nice win here. We've been struggling, so we will take any sort of win that we can get the final score is going to be 48 to 27 Oregon State with the victory and all right so my final game stats on the day for this one are going to be five tackles one for a loss a sack and an interception so not too shabby not too shabby but we're going to go ahead and get into our next game now against the Washington Huskies all right here we are in washington man this is a crazy stadium here this is gonna be a tough one here man washington's pretty good we actually beat them last season but that game was at oregon state so we're gonna throw it short daniels almost picks this one off my goodness that should have been all mine but here we go with a third and ten oh man they're gonna look to throw it short oh nice catch Bino for 23 yards. Third and two now. They're gonna, oh, nice, nice. That was nice. The play action gets me in the backfield, and that's gonna be an easy touchdown. Seven nothing, Washington. Third and ten here. 
They're gonna look. They're looking to go deep with it. Deep, 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 deep. And Daniel's gonna knock that one down. Fourth and ten. Not too shabby, but Oregon State, Oregon State would do nothing. And then here we go. Huskies in zone touchdown for Jacob Sermon. 14 nothing. One and down the end of the first quarter here. 14 to Nada. And a throw it short. And a screenplay. Daniels comes up and delivers the big hit. Third and two now. Third and two. They're going to do some sort of fake. And the running quarterback is just going to run it for the first down. I'm not sure what that was, to be honest. I'm not sure if that was a bug or if that was a design play. But whatever it was, it worked. They're going to throw it across the middle of the field. First and goal. Unreal. This one's about to get real ugly. 14 nothing. About to be 21 nothing here in a second. First and goal now. They're going to look. Looking. Give me that interception, Nick Daniels. Oh, he's gonna run this one out. Could it be? No, but Daniels gets the nice pick right there. Let's check that one out one more time. All right. Third and two here, 14 nothing. We would not score, they're gonna throw it short and it's gonna be picked off by Jaden Grant. And he is gonna go all the way down the sideline to the 20 yard line. But Oregon State would screw it all up and not score. How is that even a thing? I have no idea. But they're gonna run the ball here, get the first down. Now check this out. It's first and negative 38. Look at the screen. First and negative 38. Must have been a bug because now it's first and 10. What the heck? That was weird. They gave him like five downs almost. I'm gonna run it here. Daniel's coming up delivering the big hit there. Second and eight. First and 10 rather. They're gonna look to throw it. Daniel's biting and that's a touchdown in the corner of the end zone for Spiker. And Oregon State is down 24 to nothing. They're looking, throwing it short, and I mean, it's picked off. I think that's Jaden Robinson with the pick right there. Beautiful. All right, Oregon State would finally score. So it's 24 to 6. Seven minutes to go, fourth quarter. Here we go. They're throwing it short. It's the tight end there. That's good for eight yards. Second and three now. They're going to do a read option play with the quarterback. And he is going to get the first. Daniels comes up and makes the tackle. Six tackles for Daniels on the day. I mean, so much we can do here when we're playing Washington. But second and goal now. I'm going to give to the running back. And he is going to get in the end zone, apparently. Daniels made the big hit there, but... They're gonna give him the touchdown. Let's take another look at that. Daniel's coming up here, delivering the big shot, I guess. Yeah, Oregon State would score. Time for an onside kick here. It's gonna be no good. <laughs> Washington would recover. And that pretty much about does it right there as they would take a knee right there. And that is the game. As Oregon State kind of rallies a little bit, it's just our offense struggled so bad early on. I thought our defense kept us in it for a little bit there, but in the end, Washington Huskies were just too much. And Oregon State's down to our final game next week against Oregon. Steve Merka, it's gonna be crazy. But anyway, Washington Huskies are celebrating. Like they won the national championship out in the field for some reason. Jacob Sermon, player of the game with three total touchdowns. So that was good for him. And okay, man. So the final score in this one is going to be the Washington Huskies 34, Oregon State 20. And all right, so my final game stats on the day. Here we go. We ended up with seven total tackles and an interception in the end zone. So thanks for watching this video, y'all. And I will see you guys in our season finale. So thanks for watching. Peace out.
much love. Deuces.